Hi friends, in this video we will discuss about interior extrema theorem. So what is the beauty of this theorem? Let's study. So whenever we have given a function fx to check for maxima and minima that is maxima at certain point ya minima or minima at certain point we consider f dash x to be equal to 0. So the question arises that do every extrema that is minima or maxima the function which contains this at a certain point let that point be C at C has f dash C is equal to 0. So ye question arise hota hai ki agar koi function mein extrema exist karta hai koi point C mein to kya f dash C is equal to 0 hamesha hoga. So it is not true. It is false. But we will say that it is true because hum abhi tak yehi karte aya hai ki agar maxima or minima nikalna ho to f dash x is equal to 0 lete hai for critical points aur usse maxima or minima nikalta hai. To ye question jo tha ki agar koi function hai jis mein extrema exist karta hai at a point c has f dash is equal to c. To ye statement jo hai wo false hai. Thik hai? So kyu false hai? Because अगर हम एक modulus function का graph देखे, that is modulus function, तो वो उसका graph कुछ इस तरह है, ठीक है? Now, यहाँ पे maxima exist करेगा कुछ इस point पे, और minima भी exist करता है this में, that is हमारा ये जो function है, इसमें extrema exist करता है, मगर अगर हम at a point 0, that is 0 में check करे, तो f dash जो 0 होगा, वो not equal to 0 होगा, ठीक है, we all know that, and modulus function जो होता है, that is derivative of modulus function, derivative of mod x at x is equal to 0 does not exist, ठीक है, तो हम ये conclude किए कि f dash ये function में extrema तो exist करता है, मगर ना ही f dash 0 is equal to 0 है, और ना ही derivative of f mod of x exist करता है, तो interior extremum theorem क्या बताता है, ये बताता है कि अगर कोई function है, और c उसका interior point है, ठीक है, जो function कोई भी interval पे defined है, और c इसका interior point है, तो C में अगर extrema exist करता है, that is maxima और minima exist करता है, तो F dash C जो है, वो 0 तब होगा, अगर if derivative of F at C, at a point C exist करे, ठीक है? तो interior extremum theorem यही बताता है कि अगर C उसका interior point है कोई certain function का तो उसमें अगर extrema exist करता है that is minima और maxima exist करता है तो F dash C जो है वो 0 होगा अगर derivative of F at point C exist करे that is if let C be an interior point of the interval at which F is defined from I to R has a relative extrema if the derivative of f at c exists, then f dash c is equal to 0. This is the beauty of interior extrema theorem. Okay?